Is Cornell good for pre-med? Cornell University is a titan of academia and often a dream destination for aspiring pre-meds. With its rich history and prestigious reputation, it offers a wide range of courses and experiences as diverse as its student body. Its founding principle, any person, any study, emphasizes that anyone, regardless of their background, should have the opportunity to pursue interests in any area. But while Cornell's commitment to inclusivity, inquiry, and opportunity among students from all walks of life is well known, are Cornell's offerings actually beneficial for getting into medical school? In this video, we'll explore Cornell's academic programs, the pre-med curriculum, and some key admission statistics to help you decide if it's the right fit for your pre-med journey. As a member of the Ivy League, Cornell carries a lot of weight with medical school admissions committees. Its undergraduate acceptance rate hovers around 8%, which, while competitive, makes it one of the more accessible Ivy League options. Its rural location in the city of Ithaca in upstate New York offers a scenic and storied campus that appeals to pre-meds seeking an idyllic college experience. While it's true that each year's cohort tends to be slightly larger than at schools like Harvard or Yale, Cornell's 9 to 1 student to faculty ratio reflects its commitment to maintaining a supportive academic environment you'll still receive plenty of personalized attention as a pre-med student. In fact, Cornell produces more med school applicants than any other school in the Ivy League, and it offers strong programs to help students get into med school. Like most schools, there isn't a specific pre-med major, but all pre-med students must complete challenging prerequisite courses in subjects like biology, chemistry, organic chemistry, physics, and math, no matter which major they choose. When you're on Cornell's pre-med track, it's not just about knocking out your med school prerequisites. You'll also have some core courses to tackle, and these can differ depending on which college you're in at Cornell. For instance, if you're part of the College of Arts and Sciences, you'll need to complete what they call distribution requirements. This means you'll be taking a mix of courses from different areas like physical and biological sciences, social sciences, and even arts, literature, and culture. The good news? You've got some flexibility in picking the courses to satisfy these requirements, and sometimes your med school prerequisites will qualify. This approach reflects Cornell's dedication to an interdisciplinary education, giving you a well-rounded experience that's sure to catch the eye of medical school admissions committees. Not only are you preparing for med school, but you're also broadening your horizons along the way. However, getting top grades at Cornell can be quite a challenge. The grading system follows a traditional 4.0 scale, but Cornell is known for strict grading policies. For instance, the Dyson School of Applied Economics and Management limits the number of A pluses awarded in a class to just the top 5% of students. And while average GPAs have risen over the years, grade inflation is far from rampant here. Among pre-med prerequisite courses, grades tend to hover around the BB plus range, which can make achieving a 3.8 to 4.0 tricky. Cornell students are a motivated and competitive bunch, so standing out in your classes may require more effort than at other universities. If you're worried about maintaining a high GPA, there's an option to take some courses for a satisfactory or unsatisfactory mark. Although you won't want to take this approach with prerequisites or other core curriculum courses, it can be particularly helpful if exploring new interests outside your major without a slightly lower grade negatively impacting your chances of getting into med school. Instead, demonstrating this curiosity and intellectual diversity can work to your advantage on med school applications. Keep in mind that policies around SCU grades can vary depending on which Cornell college you belong to, so be sure to check this before registering. When it comes to extracurricular activities, Cornell has plenty to offer pre-meds. The university is widely recognized for its strong research initiatives. Through organizations like the Cornell Undergraduate Research Board, students can connect with faculty on innovative research projects. Additionally, students can participate in research at the top-ranked Whale Cornell School of Medicine through programs like Advancing Cornell Career Experiences for Science Students Access and the Traveler's Summer Research Fellowship Program, which offers experiential research training and insights into health issues that affect underserved populations. Keep in mind that Whale Cornell is located in New York City, about four hours from Ithaca, so it will be challenging to gain shadowing or volunteering experiences there during the academic year. However, Cornell fosters local partnerships with hospitals like Cayuga Medical Center or the Ithaca Free Clinic to offer pre-meds valuable hands-on experience right in Ithaca. Additionally, there are numerous student organizations dedicated to health professions where you can refine your skills and explore interests. Groups like the Cornell Pre-Medical Society and Pre-Professional Health Association offer great networking opportunities alongside the over 1,400 other student organizations. 
As you prepare your medical school applications at Cornell, you'll work with the Health Professions Advising Center, HPAC. They'll provide assistance and access to workshops on writing personal statements and interview prep. One key component is the Cornell Letter Packet, Cornell's committee letter. This includes a cover letter that introduces you and discusses the achievements of all Cornell pre-meds and two to five letters of recommendation of your choosing. If you're considering embarking on the pre-med path at Cornell, you'll find an environment that encourages exploration while providing the tools you need for success after graduation. However, personalized guidance navigating the myriad opportunities at Cornell can sometimes be lacking for an institution of this size. If you're looking for detailed answers to questions about how many volunteer or shadowing hours you really need to get into med school, what specific courses to take, extracurriculars to participate in, or what topics and formats will impress ad comms in your personal statement or secondary essays, we'd be delighted to assist you with maximizing your Cornell pre-med journey to get you into medical school.